Hey y'all, today we're gonna play the cup game. First you watch me, and then you can do it later. Notice I have my cup, and I have my two cubes. Now pay close attention. This is gonna be like one of those street magicians. Keep your eyes on the cubes. Keep your eyes on the cubes. If you don't know where they're gonna go at. Oh, hmm. There were two cubes. Now how many do you see? Looks like there's one cube there, the green one. So how many are under the cup? Let's look. Did you say one? You were right. Let's see, how did you figure that out? Well, if there's one here and there's supposed to be two, that's one, two. Must be one under the cup. Or you could say, we had two cubes, but now I only see one. There must be one under the cup. Let's go a little bit harder. Hmm. This time, let's go with four cubes. Count them to double check that Mr. B put out four cubes. Go ahead, take a look. No tricks yet, but I'm about to try and trick you. If you have something to write on, write down number four right now. All right, keep your eyes on the cubes, because here I go. I'm mixing them up. They're mixing around. Oh, my goodness, where are they going to go? And, oh. <laughs> oh, my goodness. There were four cubes, but now I only see one, two cubes. How many are under the cup? Let's put that in our number bond. You can also call that a fact family. There were four, now I only see two. How are you gonna figure that out? How many are under the cup? Well, we could do it the subtraction way first. If there was four cubes, one, two, three, four, but now I only see two, one, two, there must be two under the cup. Let's look. Cha-ching! Look at that. One, two, just like we thought. What's another way for us to solve that? Hmm. Well, I know I have two, but I'm supposed to have four. Two plus what makes four? One, two, three, four. Two plus two makes four. And that's what under the cup shows us. What do you think? Did you get four? Do you want to go a little bit harder, a little bit higher? Let's do it. What we're doing here, kids, is called building your number sense. That's your understanding how numbers work together. And now we're going to work with the number six. Let's double check to make sure I'm not tricking you yet, because I'm about to try. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's put six up on the board. If you're riding along at home or typing, you can put six down too, because I'm going to make some disappear under the cup. Keep your eyes on the cup. Keep your eyes on the cubes. At oh, mix them up. Mix them up. Whoa, whoa. 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 Hey, pay attention. And oh my goodness, look at that. Hmm. A moment ago. There were six cubes, but now there's just two. What did I do? Whew, I put some under the cup. Do you know how many? There were six total, but now there's only two. Let's put that in our fact family. Six is the whole, and two, one, two, is part. What part is missing? Hmm... I'm going to use subtraction to figure that out first. I had six, but now I only have two. Let's take away these two to see how many are under the cup. One, two. Now I have one, two, three, four fingers up. There must be four under the cup. Goodness gracious, there are four under here. Look at that. The green one, the blue one, the red one, and the orange one. And here was my two, the brown and black one. Two and four. 
What's another way to solve that? What about addition? Two plus something makes six. Let's see here. I think I can count up. I'll start on my two. One, two, three, four, five, six. I counted on four more. One, two, three, four. Plus two makes six. And we can double check that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Two plus four makes six. All right, now it's your turn with a partner to play the cup game. Someone take the cup and the objects, mix it up, hide some, and then the partner has to figure out how many are under the cup. If you're by yourself, don't worry. You can play by yourself. Just close your eyes, mix things up, and then cover some things up. And then when you look, you're going to have to figure out how many did you cover up. Have fun. And know why you're having fun. You're building your math brain. See you later, kids. Thank you for watching, and please check out one of our premier episodes. They're linked in the description, or you can find them at the Mr. B's Brain homepage. I think you'll find them just as useful and perhaps a little more entertaining. My personal favorites are Subtraction Magic and Addition Game Show. Enjoy!